grab, and go. In car lines with some old and new faces. Have a good meal and, and get back on the bus. That's all, you know, I get it and go. An unfamiliar way of operating for the City of Abilene Senior Service Division, says Bobby Brown, Division Manager, implementing new safety precautions for our seniors. It, it's a lot different, uh, uh, but the, the phenomenal thing about it is the, the number has increased. Gradually increasing since March, they've gone from feeding 200 seniors a day to feeding over 400. Uh, we're now serving more meals than we were when all of our sites were open. Finishing July with 39,000 meals, he says the 50,000 mark is right around the corner. They don't know, but whoever gets that 50,000 meal, we're going to throw some confetti and let some balloons off and maybe give out a, few, a gift basket or something like that just to let them know that we're counting and, and, and we, we really appreciate their participation. You know. COVID putting a damper on physical and recreational activities. Mental health is at stake, especially for those longing for their usual interactions. Well, I'm hoping they'll open their, do their dancing and, and their Western music here before long. I mean, that would be nice to have again. But says they're working on creative and safer ideas on gathering to close that gap, weather permitting. And then we also are we're, we're trying to put together a drive-in movie to where we want to put our blow-up screen out you know, and, and show a movie where, and they can sit in their cars. But for the foreseeable future, he says they'll just have to continue their lunch program. In Abilene with coverage you can count on, Kevin Clack, KTAB News.